find their home here, and they build and they raise their young, and I have actually witnessed, well, you have too, animals that take better care of their youngins than people do. Some people do. They truly do. So as nature's bright eye winks a welcome, and my heart turns to the true in life with a whole lot less distractions, and I sense a kinship, a presence, in every form that God manifests Himself. And he created nature to soothe our every ill and teach our quiet lessons. Doesn't it say some word, be still and know that I am God? Be still. I think sometimes, Jamie, we sing sweet hour of prayer and bless the Lord. I, sometimes I can't find 15 minutes. You know, I'm convicted of that sometimes. And how what precious times it is to be alone with the Father. God is supernatural. Could we say supernature? Amen. Many times in the Bible you'll find Jesus by a stream, near a lake, walking on the water, a garden, a mountain. Why? Because there's healing in nature. <coughs> there truly is. Nature is God. I ain't no preacher, but one time Jesus said, Consider the lily, how it grows. Now, my carnal mind wants to know how much pH balance is in the soil and how much fertilizer to put on it and this and that. How do you round it up and hoe it? We miss it like that. It simply grows because God is in it. That's it. God is in it. 